we have a rod between temperatures t1 and t2 and heat conductivity is not constant so it's alpha by t we need to find temperature as a function of x and what should be the heat flow density so this is nothing but heat current dq by dt so quite obviously since k is variable we have to consider an and it's variable and it's dependent on temperature so we have to consider an element at which we have to assume the temperature is t such that we can write k for that element alone and we'll write heat current for that which will be constant for the whole rod so that is our approach let's start there so at distance x we are taking the element dx and at the beginning the temperature is t and at the after dx the temperature becomes t plus dt so for this element alone we are going to write uh, our standard equation heat flow equation so dq by dt is equal to ka so t minus t plus dt upon dx so this comes to be dq by dt into dx equal to alpha by t a minus dt now since dq by dt is a constant so we have only two terms of uh, variables are x and temperature so now we can integrate first our integration will be from 0 to l where temperature changes from t1 to t2 so we do that and we get dq by dt that comes to be this so that is the heat flow density second part because we need temperature at a distance x so our limits are going to be the limits of x will be from 0 to x and limits of temperature will be from t1 to t so we do that in the same equation and we get this equation so this is temperature as a function of x but we have a term of dq by dt here so we'll just replace that from what we found here and get our answer so temperature as a function of x is t1 into t2 by t1 power x by l all right